Inequality is getting greater. The rich are getting richer. Everyone else is struggling. Is that fair? Yes! Bankers made hundreds of billions in the run-up to the crash. Then all of us gave them hundreds of billions to pay off their debts. So we were in debt. Cheers. Because we are all in this together. There will be cutbacks, closures, jobs will be lost. Did the bankers pay back their huge bonuses? No. They carried on making more money. This is what we've come to expect as normal. It doesn't have to be like this. You've got to have some bankers going to prison for criminal behaviour. I'm looking for Fred Goodwin. We're from Subsection, please. Did Come you know about the 500 million in bonuses last year? Did you get some of that? No, I'm not. I'm sure. starting to think that you're involved in some high-level financial <laughs> skullduggery. A cleaner working in the city would have to work 300 years to make the same amount their boss would make in a year. People in the same office, but living in different worlds. Some people have so much, some people have nothing. This is the institutionalization of greed. Yeah. It's Russell Brand to speak to Lord Rothermere. Say it's about uh, living here and taxes. Hello? Every crisis is an opportunity to change the system, to change direction. Power isn't there. Power is here. The Benin Estates did pull out of the purchase of the estate, so that was yeah, amazing. That was amazing. Our challenge as people is to say, we will not let this happen anymore. We will bring back power into our own hands. Things can change. Things do change. So I'll wait here, see if he's around. He's not around. He must be up there working. Yeah. Four million a year, he's probably grafting. <laughs>